Hello guys, how are you? It's beautiful sunny Monday here in Poland. We have still holiday and so some family stuff planned for today. I would like to thank you very much for enormous support and warm messages and <laughs> frankly speaking when I woke up yesterday and I saw so many messages I said hey something's something's wrong and I think maybe my service is wrong <laughs> and then I discovered that Joshua Bardwell covered um, toolbox in his uh, channel by the way Josh thank you very much for for cover and glad you like my three years uh, long um, uh, journey with the application all right morning coffee and by the way the mark says eres papa mas guapo del mundo which translates um, you are uh, the most handsome dad in the world at least my daughter thinks so thank you for the coffee as always all right I have a lot of questions about running toolbox in background. A lot, a lot. I know, I know, it's very useful. And this is daily, uh, daily tool, so it should be accessible very easily. Let me power my Zoro. Oops. Let me mute. Uh, I love this song, but fly me to the moon, but I will have a copyright strike. <laughs> All right, so. Uh, just um, just look, uh, it, now it's running, it's configured to run in background on BMW radios. You just press telemetry, bam, and we have it. And everything works. Let me switch radio, let me switch my little bird. It works with uh, bigger birds, but this one fits nicely in the frame. Ah, oh, again, hopefully not the copyright strike. <laughs> all right, sweet child of mine. Um, all right, so it works. You just exit, right? And you are quickly, uh, long press and you are quickly in the system. Then pressing tele will go to, um, to, to, the, to the toolbox once configured. If you don't know how, just check FAQ on the website how to put and where to put telemetry script that allows toolbox to work uh, in the background. All right, and there's one minor thing I found. If you want to switch config in background mode, you can't. This is HTX bug. It's not passing those um, key events to, um, to Lua in um, background mode, and, but still, it's working in background mode, but still you can go to uh, tools and then run it as a standalone mode. And then as a standalone mode, in standalone mode, um, let's go to config. It works, of course. So we will, most probably it will be nightly as 2.7, HTX 2.7 is out now, so I haven't managed to include this bug in, in 2.7. All right, so that, that's it. So let me switch to, um, to another radio. Um, so background mode works on black and white radio targets. All right, and that's it. Uh, let me check. As you can see, I've got already widget. Widget is a thing that runs in background in color LCD um, uh, radios. So it's already, uh, it's already, let me check. Does it connect? No, why not? Maybe it's not configured properly. Once again, let me check. Yeah. And that's, uh, that's, you know, <laughs> I'm working on that. I'm working on that, uh, still some bugs, but this is, let me re 
boot my radio and show you because there are some things to be fixed with telemetry readings let me reboot my radio and um, this is widget so it works in background double tap bam we are in a, uh, in a application exit double tap very quick and it will be covered in in version 0.80 right all right guys thank you very much thank you for the coffee cheers